I haven't ever done a series on Invader Lands Factions. I've pondered it twice. Uh, I've even ended up recording an episode of Invader Lands Factions and then deleting it after deciding, you know, I'm not going to play here. Hey there guys, MCB here, and today we are going to be playing some Minecraft Invaded Lands Factions. My PC is back, finally! Uh, basically, I, I got my PC set up a few days ago, but I haven't really been able to play on it due to having to have Wi-Fi on my PC. I'm gonna say the same stuff in tomorrow's PC video as well. Um, and so basically, I, I just haven't been able to make any PC videos, but I went out and, uh, earlier today at like 1 o'clock or something like that, it was like 12.31, so sometime between then. Uh, I went out and I bought myself a, um, a uh, wireless USB adapter thing for my Wi-Fi, and now I can actually get Wi-Fi on my computer. I know that does not sound like something very hard. It is. Where I, li I live literally, like, next to a forest now. Uh, the Wi-Fi is actually not bad. It's, it's good Wi-Fi. It's just that... I can't get it through walls, and there's a bunch of interference and all that, so I got a new adapter uh, that works better than just my tablet's tethering, and uh, now I can do stuff, so that's pretty cool. But anyways, welcome to Invaded Lands Factions. You guys all know Invaded Lands. I know Invaded Lands. I've been playing on here for almost a year now, um, but not on Factions, obviously, and I've been recording for a little while as well. But I haven't ever done a series on Invaded Lands Factions. I've pondered it twice. Uh, I've even ended up recording an episode of Invaded Lands Factions and then deleting it after deciding, you know, I'm not going to play here because of uh, resets and stuff. But recently, the Factions server has reset. So we are going to be starting our brand new, uh, I guess, playthrough of Invaded Lands Factions. And you can tell that's reset by the fact that number one faction uh, has only that much you would expect them to have like a hundred times that basically but yeah anyways i'm gonna go ahead and uh do some get go slash wild and uh let's see what we can find see if we can find a good place to make our base all right so we found a place, it's not really a place that we're going to be able to make a base in, but it is a place that is covered in trees, which we'll be using for our uh, chests. Now we are going to be making a sky base here, as we typically do, because we are the lords of sky base building. Uh, we're, we're very good at it. So we're going to find an area where we can build a sky base, preferably using my uh, patent pending... I actually didn't make this generous and did go... go go to him, he's a pretty cool YouTuber, I don't watch him anymore, but yeah, I do not know what that lag spike was at all, but uh, it was there, so uh, I'm going to turn my volume down so that I don't get too much echo on the speakers, because I have in-game volume being recorded, as well as my microphone, which is sort of kind of next to the speaker, so I don't want to be confusing you guys as to why you can hear stuff twice, like half a millisecond apart from each other. Anyways, um, yeah, so... We need to get some wood so that we can build a sky base, preferably above the mushroom tree, as I've shown you guys before. Sachi's. Oh, Sachi's place here. Yeah, so, I, I gotta say this to you guys. Uh, I don't really know how else I'm supposed to, like, reveal this, but Invaded Lands is uh, no longer Invaded Lands. Let's let's just say that. I'll, I'll show you guys. So, Invaded Lands is a pretty, it's a pretty great server, alright? But it kind of is a dime. Or at least it kind of was. Oh, hello, Skeppy. Apparently, Skeppy's in the lobby. That's that's cool. It kind of not is, but it was dying. All right, it was dying. Okay, so recently, um, due to that, they've done a merge um, with other servers, and uh, they kind of sort of did like a partnership with Skycade, but they didn't work out. So instead, they just they have decided that they are going to merge with the one the only mindmen.club you guys can see this mindmen.club and if i do slash hub it will take me back to invaderlands.net so there's not really anything big there but basically they've merged now and you guys can see like if you there's 89 players here there's a global amount of 382 players that's pretty insane so the server has definitely been revived but there might be some toxicity problems due to the fact that my men.club 
is closer to like Velt and Zonix and all those than anything else. So there will probably be quite a few toxic players that originate from my Menda Club, and will probably more than like quadruple the server's toxicity overall. But I'm not gonna quit it because I don't think it's too bad. I, I think I'll be able to handle it. I do. I I personally really don't like toxic players. I really I really don't. But I think that this won't be too bad. I am sorry for killing you while you were having an egg. I'm very sorry. Okay. Uh, I need to get as much food as I can here because I, we don't get food in our, like, you know, starting kit, whatever. Unless there's a kit I don't know about. Oh, there is. Never mind. I didn't need to mercilessly murder all of those chickens. So I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna pretend that never happened. Um, but we have a stack of wood here. Alright, good. Now we need to get ourselves some dirt, so let's dig through all this dirt. Um, so as I said, since we are going to be doing a sky base, and I'm sorry if it's lagging a little bit for you guys, it is for me too, like I'm getting only 40 frames a second right now. I'm probably going to be getting a new either graphics card or computer, or both. It's very likely that I'm going to get both, because I'm, I'm definitely getting a new graphics card at some point. And I'm most likely getting a new computer. Like, there's probably like a 90-something percent chance. Uh, that I'm getting a new computer, but uh, when I do that, obviously Minecraft will not be lagging anymore, and I will be able to record for you guys in, at the very least, 720p, 60 frames a second. Most likely, I'll even be able to do 1080p, uh, maybe 120 frames, maybe 240. I don't know. I don't know exactly how I'm going to record this, uh, but I will be trying to make it very, very high quality videos from then on. So yeah. Anyways, uh, we have probably around. We don't have quite enough dirt, but we, we're, we're getting close. Uh, we, we probably need about three stacks of dirt, and we have one and a half, so... Uh, yeah. But, anyways. I said anyways. I'm saying anyways too much. I, I've realized that. I'm gonna try to cut down on saying any, anyways, because I can get that's a little annoying and a little repetitive, so I'm gonna try not to do that. But, anyways. I'm joking, I'm joking. Uh, and we have broken our shovel. Okay. Well, that's, that's wonderful. Are we able to do slash wild again? Wait, zero. Oh wow, that was a really that was a big coincidence right there. I was not expecting that. We timed it perfectly. Perfectly. Alright, so Um Let me do F3. I wanna see we're at 74 here. Now if we do all this, this will bring us up like 140-ish. But we need to get to Yeah, so that's not gonna work. Okay, uh let's let's keep mining. Some more dirt. We need to we need to get to the end of the stack. And once we get to the end of the stack, I'll go slash wild again and find a good place to make our base. So yeah. Alright, so I haven't found um what I was looking for, which was a mushroom tree. <clears throat> but I found something that may work, hopefully, if I'm lucky enough. I'll have to check it later on, but I mean maybe if I do this I'll be able to find a mushroom tree, but you guys can see there is literally none in sight, so I've kind of given up on that whole idea, and instead of mushroom tree, we're going to be doing sand. I know, amazing, guys, amazing. Well, let's go ahead and load up to Y256, or, well, closer to 250, I think 250 would be better. But, uh, yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and eat some steak here. on top, right, and bring this down. Alright, so right about here, guys, is where we are going to be creating our base. So let's go ahead and make ourselves a crafting table. And by the way, if you're wondering how I got all this loot, it's because it's a starter kit. Uh, and... Is it this way? Yeah, this way. Alright, so this will be our crafting table. And then we can go two double chests out from here. So let's grab this on double chests. Alright. Mine through this. And this. Or not, because I'm going to lag spike instead. Uh, let's hop over here, see if we can maybe pick all these up. Hopefully without them all falling. Nope. Okay. Not going to work. Alright, let's jump down, right here, 
and retrieve all the chests, and it looks like they're down here, so shouldn't be too hard. How many chests is that? Four of these and 17 of these. That looks right. I'm pretty sure that's right. Let's go back up to home here. Let's do... No, I can't do that. Can I do this? Yes, I can. All right. Can I do then this? I can't. No. All right. Can I do this? Yes, I can. Then do this and do. Let me break these. Cause I realized why the thing wasn't working. I kind of realized that. All right. I'm tired. Give me, uh, give me some leniency, please. Thank you. Let's grab these. Is that all? That's all. Okay. I hope people don't notice that. Home here. All right. Uh, let's put what this goes right here, right? No, like this. Okay. And then this. All right. So we're we're out of iron now, sadly. Um, so we can't do much more, but basically, with all that, what, what we're gonna, once this is finished, uh, there's gonna be another double chest right here, and then this side will be, like, crafting table, furnace, enchantment table, anvil, well, maybe anvil, I don't know, and some other thing, probably. So, some micro uh, furnace right here, and put that right here, okay. So, uh, I believe after this we need to, what was it that we need? Hopefully, if, if we can find some sort of, like, wool, that'd be nice. I doubt we're gonna be able to, but, uh, uh if I, uh, if I do stuff sell, is that a thing here that I can do? If I sell ham? I can do that! Alright, let's just, let's just grab everything in here that we can sell and sell it all. Except for our steak. Don't, don't sell that. Uh, so let's, let's sell all. 226 items. Nice. 1,564. I don't know exactly what we sold, but I'm sure it was pretty good. Alright. So now that we've sold all of that, let's go ahead and buy uh, one more iron ingot. And some wool. So, slash shop. Uh, where, where is that? Shop where? Oh, you. Uh, I think you can. Okay, that's how I got most of my money. I sold my obsidian. I would assume, unless maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't sell my obsidian, but I, I think I did. Anyways, <sighs> that's the H. Shop. Miscellaneous. No. Spawners. Farming. Where, where ingots? Okay, here we go. Uh, and let's buy one of these. Confirm. There we go. Seventy-nine dollars. Worth it. Okay. And let's buy some more uh, chests. Just like that. I'm sure this won't take too long. Let's let's buy this much. Confirm. All right. More sticks. And there we go. Got our trap chest. Let's place them right here. So now we've got our full base done. Um, other than, you know, the hiding and stuff, we're going to have to camouflage it. Now I'm planning on camouflaging it by, if I can find some wool, I, I will, but it, it doesn't look like I have yet. Uh, so we're going to get white wool here, obviously, and then probably light blue dye. So let's buy, uh, confirm. That's not ink sacks, but whatever. And confirm. <sighs> Alright, now we can't slash fly, so we're gonna have to do this in the next episode once we once I make like a little overpass. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video. This is gonna be where I'm storing my stuff for now. Leave a like, subscribe, and peace.